Uh, let's see. Okay, so from here, we should be able to do a little... Yeah, we should be in the lower. Haha, <laughs> I remember. I love this guy. Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? <laughs> <laughs> He's so cheerful. <laughs> Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good. I love the Solarians. I love that there's actually a race that look like the Greys, right? Right, yeah. What all you would do? What all you got? Yeah. Can't afford this stuff right now. Okay, bye. I don't think there's a keeper down here. Yeah. There's the stairs. Okay, that's that's where I want to go. Oh no. Is it time? Is that really Wow? It's you. It's time. You're Commander Shepard, the hero of Eden Prime. I am so honored to meet you. How would you like to deal with this fellow? Uh, <laughs> uh this is kind of weird. Um uh Hello. Hello. Nice to meet you. And you are? My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. <laughs> really? They say a lot of things. I was too busy killing them to count. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Sure. Uh, I mean, I suppose. Yeah, no problem. Well, we, yeah. No problem. No yeah. problem. Yeah. Doesn't really matter. Anything for a fan. Unless you're like, Here. no. Right. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. I'll let you get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. <laughs> wow. So uh, that was a mission that just got added to our journal. We wow. Have, okay. The fan. Uh, you have been approached funny. by Conrad Werner. He seems like a harmless fan. You probably haven't seen the last of Conrad. What harm could there be in talking with him when you meet him again? Uh. Hey, what's up? Hello, Earth Clan. No doubt you've just come back from the colonies. Will you be needing supplies? Yes. Colonies? What colonies are you talking about? Oh, my mistake, Earth Clan. I assumed it doesn't matter. Pharos? Novaria? Well, if you haven't heard of them yet, I'm sure you will soon. But it doesn't matter where you hail from. My goods are available to all. What you got? We don't really need to talk to about the plants. We'll find out about them later. Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. Do you have any... Yes, this is what I'm looking for. Licenses. I want licenses. Hello. Best place on this ward to buy upgrades. Wow, you're all so friendly. <laughs> yeah, so that, that guy is just, uh, he's foreshadowing, dude, because Pharos and Ovaria places will go later. Oh, okay, right. Oh, oh, oh. Look, I know it was you. I remember your face. Really, that's impressive. Usually, you humans can't tell one Turian from another. This was the place. Now, are you going to give me a refund or not? Do you have your proof of purchase? What? No, no, I, I, I don't think you ever gave me one. I'm sorry, Dave. I can't help you. But, what would you... Can't help you. Yeah. <laughs> Little do we know, this is the start of a saga. Excuse me. Ugh. Yeah, some conversations keep going every time you run by. Let me through. Thank you. What's up? Ooh. Commander Shepard? Excuse me, Commander Shepard! Yes? I'm Emily Wong. I'm an investigative journalist working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? Sure. What do you need? I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. I was hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. So, what? how is this uh, relevant? How do you know that my investigation is going to uncover anything you need? You wouldn't be investigating if it weren't big. And if it's big, it's something I'd like to hear about. Alright. 
But why me? You gotta have access to better sources. Why contact me? I'm using every source I can find, but I think I've got a better shot with you. According to your file, you survived back on Akuz when everyone else in your squad got killed. If anyone can find the worst elements of the Citadel and live to tell about it, it's you. That's a weird reason, but okay. <laughs> How do you know I'm investigating anything here on the Citadel? I'm a good journalist, Commander Shepard. Word gets around. Yeah, sure. Sounds like a good cause. If I find any information, it's yours. Thank you, Commander. You won't regret it. Cool. Uh, let's see. Um, there's, well, let's go ahead and go up here. We'll get uh, one or two missions from here for later. You want to run, girl? Thank you. Oh yeah. Welcome to the club. Gross. <laughs> it's out of my hands, Rita. I'd bring her back in a second, but she doesn't want to come. No, no. I'll see if I can talk some sense into her next time I see her. What's up? Be careful. You know how stubborn your sister can be. I'm gonna dance. The more you push <laughs> and prod, the more she'll run away. Yeah, you're probably right. Thanks, Dora. Sorry, I'm kind of busy right now. So, uh, what can I do for you? Problem. What were you discussing with the Volus? Who, Doran? Oh, uh, I was just asking him about my sister. See, she worked for Doran before she left to... Ugh, sorry. I don't want to bore you with my problems. One of the only NPCs in any of these games that goes like, wait, 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 wait. It, it's cool. I got this. <laughs> That's right. And then you're like, no, it's all right. It's all right. I'm interested to hear what you have to say. It's all right. Give me your, give well, me your quest. Okay. My sister Jenna left here to go work at Cora's Den. The problem is, she's working as an informant for CSEC. You know, eavesdropping on the people there. If they find out what she's doing, they'll kill her. Well, that's not good. Being an informant is a dangerous job. That's what I've been telling her. Mm, I don't know. Sometimes I think she stays there just to spite me. I keep, I keep hearing a background voice that I think is not supposed to be as loud as it is, but it's just some guy going like blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Do you know who her contact at CSEC is? No, it's all very secret. Last time I asked an officer, he told me to stay out of it for Jenna's safety. I got it. Maybe I could help her understand just how dangerous Cora's Dan is. Would you? That'd be great. Just don't got tell her I <laughs> Well, I should get back to work before I get in trouble. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, hey. Doran, what's up? Welcome to Flux. Name's Doran. What can I do for you? Is this a casino? Among other things. Yeah, there's yes. a casino upstairs. We've got some quasar stations, uh, if you're interested. What can you tell me about the sisters working for you? Well, Jenna left to work at Cora's Den. Now her sister Rita is all worried she might be in some kind of trouble. Not much chance Jenna will change her mind, though. She's a stubborn one. If she wanted to come back, I'd take her in a second. The customers loved her. So you own this place? Are you the owner? Owner, cook, and bartender. I've even been known to dance a little when the mood strikes me. <laughs> <laughs> We've got some quasar stations, uh, if you're interested. Goodbye. Enjoy your time here at Flux. Sure. <laughs> the old loop here. Those little guys are kind of fun. I like the Volus, little bowling balls. <laughs> Drinks and dancing down below, gambling up above. Good place to blow off some steam. I'm glad you're excited about something. <laughs> oh man, my sister would love this place. Maybe when this is all over, I'll bring them here for a girls' night out. Sounds good. What's I have to say I love I love a little guy, you know. Yeah, 
Yeah. It's a little guys, dude. and I it's like. If someone had to ask me, like, who's your favorite character in, like, Star Trek Deep Space Nine, I'd have a hard time not saying Quark. He's just a little guy. <laughs> He's just a little guy. My favorite little guy. Nice hair, dude. How's everybody doing? Man, that's a loud dress. <laughs> What's up? Hello? I'm waiting for someone else. The white people dancing. The white people That's how dancing. I dance. uh, we're not it's gonna embarrassing, we're, but <laughs> we're not gonna play any quasar right now. We'll play some later. But there is a keeper. Ooh. Keeper. And we'll yell hello at the machine. <laughs> All right. I was trying to make one of my channel point thingies that sound. <laughs> Yeah, I've had I've tried to find it isolated. It's hard to get isolated. Yeah, I tried to find it as well and I did I had a bad time. Yeah, it was rough. Okay. Whoa. Had a moment, had a loading moment. Uh not going that way just yet. We're gonna go actually before we go across, let's go down here because there's some I know there's someone down here to talk to. Um and there's a keeper. Keeper. And Codex. And Officer Lang. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? I saw the monument at Akuz. They got a whole section about you there. It's a miracle you survived. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry, I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang, Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Um, yes, maybe. Um... I've already met Harkin, but uh, what's up? What what can you tell me? How do you me? like working here? What, what do you like? What, what do you like? This here? place is amazing. I've been here almost a year, and I still haven't seen a tenth of it. The Presidium's just so beautiful. Good place to go and relax. But I really like it here down in the wards. There's always something going on somewhere, like that new club they just opened a few months ago, Flux. Wicked scene in there, Commander. You should check it out when you have some so, time. So I want to know why this one guy out of everyone has this weird earpiece. <laughs> right. Why'd you join Citadel Security? I don't know. Seemed like the right thing to do, you know? Maybe it's in my blood. My grandfather was a cop back on Earth. It's kind of what CSEC is. Police for the Citadel. I'm still pretty new at it, but I like it so far. Way more interesting than staying back on Earth. You get to meet all kinds of cool aliens. Like those Hanar. Wild. Plus, CSEC gets a lot of respect here. We uphold the law. People, even aliens, appreciate that. What do you know about Spectre? That's a weird way to put it, but okay. Just the stuff they show in the right. parades. They always make them out to be super agents on secret missions to save the galaxy. I know it's not really like that, though. Some of the other CSEC guys don't like them too much. Figure they shouldn't be able to operate outside the law. But if they were so bad, the council wouldn't use them, right? Do you know a CSEC officer named Harkin? I shouldn't really say too much. He's been on the force a lot longer than me. But I've heard things, you know? Drinking on the job, taking bribes, that kind of thing. Rumors mostly, but they suspended him, so some of it must be true. I have to go. Right. You're probably <laughs> real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. Nice kid. That's all I've got to say about that loser. <laughs> yeah. Harkin. <laughs> exactly. Blech. Blech. Okay, let's see here. Where is the... That's just the path. Okay. So the keeper must be around this corner. I know there's one back here. They're always hiding them. There we go. Question. How many how many we got? We gotta be doing pretty good. 17 out of 20. And I can think nice. of where number 18 is off the top of my head, so it's just the other two we have to find. I didn't tell anyone, wow, that's I amazing. Swear. That was smart, Doc. Oh shit. Now if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... Who are you? Let her go. Ah! Damn. Whoa. Character established. Uh, yeah. Take cover. Honestly, hang on. I'd rather have this. You should switch to that. Oh. Ha ha. Done. Yep, we good. Area secured. Okay, put 
your weapons away, please. Hello. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. <laughs> it was a nice shot, but also, oh my god. That it shot. was also a big risk. It was a big um, risk. What were yeah. you thinking? You could have hit the hostage. There wasn't time to think. I just reacted. I didn't mean to. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? <laughs> no, I'm okay. Thanks to you. All of you. He's like, man, that was awesome. Oh, wait. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. Are you okay? <laughs> right. <laughs> he's a little, he's a bit of a hothead, like Herkin said. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we, we got you. What? What? I know those men threatened What's going on? You, but if you tell us who they work for, we can protect you. They work for Feast. Oh, shit. They wanted to shut me up. Keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. What Quarian? What Quarian? A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Gotcha. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Uh-oh. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid, even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. She must have something that proves he's a traitor. Did the Quarian mention anything about Saren or the Geth? She did. The information she was going to trade. She said it had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Well, we better go find her. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. You're a Turian. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the council and a disgrace to my people. Uh, yeah, okay, you made your case, dude. <laughs> uh, yeah. Welcome aboard, Garrus. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Heard about that. Yeah, we heard about him. Oh, uh, I think we could use him. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the academy before he leaves. Move out. All right. We finally have enough people that we get to choose who we're going with. Garrus, yes. get in here. For the love of God. Uh, yeah. Get Ashley out of here. <laughs> as quickly as possible. How are we doing? If you feel lucky, we should visit the casino over in Flux. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, Dr. Michelle? I never properly thanked you for saving me from Fist's thugs, Commander. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't been there. You're a doctor. How did you end up here on the Citadel? My parents brought me here when I was young. That must have been My interesting. My father was a medic with yeah. the parents. I chose to keep the medical tradition alive, but not the military. Fixing up wounded soldiers isn't my idea of fun. Fair enough. You're a doctor. Oh, my, sorry. My, I thought there was another. I chose to keep the medical tradition um, alive. Let me take a look at what of you got. Of course. What you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? Um, anything? No. No. Okay. Thank you. Replenish Metagel. Freebie. Um, nice. Let's see. Okay. So we are we are we are at a crossroads. Um, we can go get Rex, or we can go take care of Fist first. It's up to you. Because hmm. we're, we're basically, we're not that far from, from Fist's club, but at the same time, like, we could also go get Rex first. Um, uh, we can get Rex, why not? Sure. Took almost six hours, and we only saw one tenth of the ship. I even got to meet the commander, Matriarch Ladanya. You met her? Well, she addressed everyone on the tour, <laughs> but I got pretty close to her. Huh, just look at that ship. You'd have to be stupid to mess with that. Very true. Let's see. Where is the spot? There's a spot along here. Must might have missed it. 
uh, where Kate and Ashley will have a little convo, but it's it's literally just them being like, wow, this place is big. <laughs> um, okay. I don't remember where this leads to, so we'll go this way to make sure we don't miss any capas. Oh, I do know. I do know. I do know. Okay. Um, faster way to get to Seasec, I think, is back where Officer Ling was, right? Gotta go to the Seasec Academy. Yeah, okay. Downstairs. Walking everywhere helps you find keepers. Let's go. Can't jog for very long. All right. Oh my god, Caden, where are you? <laughs> a Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Oh. And our protesters have blockaded the dig site, <laughs> claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call them, should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. Got it. Sounds about right. Right, where, where precisely are we? Ah, uh, ah, perfect. Hello. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. <laughs> I love you, Rex. <laughs> Go on. Get out of here. Do I know you, human? My fist is mine. <laughs> My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. <sighs> Shepard. Commander Shepard. I've heard a lot about you. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. So you'll join? <laughs> Get in here. Glad to have you on the team, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. Okay. So, here's... The deal. We can totally bring Rex, but he will kill Fist. Oh, right. So as long okay. as you're okay with that, straight up, I'll just... He probably randomly shows up in some itsy-bitsy scene or something in one of the other games if you don't kill him. But, like... It's not important. <laughs> oh, it's okay if we kill him. He seems like a pretty bad he person. He sounds like an <laughs> asshole, honestly. I don't really have a problem with it. So, okay, yeah. That sounds good to me. So si say hello to my favorite team. The only team. The best team. Uh, yeah, that works for me <laughs> as well. I also like both of these characters. They're, they're great. They're like the best ones. So, you know. I used to have an office here. I spent half my time doing paperwork. Yeah, just... Just putting it into perspective, technically Garrus is like, fuck the police, I'm coming with you. Right. Good man. Good man, Garrus. Yeah, and definitely. C-Sec brings me here for a friendly chat. Indeed they do. Alright, y'all, <laughs> you just you just wait right there. I'm gonna go look for keepers real quick. I think I think Okay, Jaleen. Let me get this. Oh this. Your business partner, Chorbin. We built we met Chorbin. Well, no, uh, not exactly. But he wants to meet with me. I think he's going to kill me. And why do you think that? <laughs> I, I can't really get into the details. But Shorbin will kill me if I leave here unprotected. I can't help you. Not unless you give me something more to go on. I, I can't. I'm sorry. Then I've got other work to do. But I... But nothing. Don't bother me unless you're willing to give me details. Damn. All right. I mean, that's fair. Hey there. Oh, you're not C-Sec, are you? <laughs> He's about to plead his case again. Did you want something? <laughs> what were you trying to explain to the officer before? My colleague is trying to kill me. 
And I thought we were friends. That's a pretty big claim. How do you know he right? wants you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. <laughs> the, the tone of Yesterday, voice. Yesterday, he followed me all the way <laughs> he home, just waiting me. for a chance. I don't care what anyone thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. What? 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 Is there something what, I can what do? What do you want me to do? Uh, talk to your friend, maybe. Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me alone. Fair. He thinks he can just push me around, but you'll show him, won't you? All right, I'll, I'll talk to him. Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Oh, right. Well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. His name's Shorban. He's a Salarian. You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. Shorban. That's the guy who wanted us to scam the keepers. Never mind that I wasn't there for that. The keepers? Right. Well, even more reason to go after him. That's against regulations. I see. I better look into this right away. Find out what he's up to. Anything's possible with Shorbin these days. Well, good luck. <laughs> uh-huh. Hello. Hello, Commander. Hi, how do you know who I am? Let's see. I'm pretty sure there's one up here. Pretty sure. Yes, there you are. I scans you. Because I get stuck between the chairs. <laughs> Give me codex. Give me free experience. Aw, oh, yeah. All the free experience. Okay. Ooh, there's a weapons locker back here. Can I just... Okay, Codex. I was like, am I stealing? I have... <laughs> oh my god. Child. What on earth just happened? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Take one more peek. Okay. Should be good to go back downstairs from this side. Let's make sure. So we came up from there. I... We don't... We don't need elevators. Uh, we should check here, though. Ah, yeah. Keeper. Nice. And? One sec. Hooking you up. Requisition officer. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? You got it. How did you know all that? I'm the it's the cops. <laughs> yeah, sure right. Our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today? What you got? Do you have Shepherd? any licenses? Show me what you got. Excellent. I hope you find what you're looking for. Any licenses? Got a grenade upgrade. I will take that, and I will take the license. Thank you. Those are the things I usually buy. Nice. Because the upgrades for things like grenades and meta gel help you carry more. Cool. Okay. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna we're gonna rapid transit over to Cora's den. And uh, actually let me peek in here because I think this is this is the markets, right? So we can deal with Chorbin real quick. Hey buddy, so what is the deal? What's going on? Commander, I wasn't expecting to see you again. Is there something you want? No more lies. Give me the, give, give me, give me, give me the truth. You can start by telling me the truth, Shorban. I'm not sure what you're referring to. My experiments are. We're not buying it. Jalid told us you've been after it. You spoke with Jalid. Then you know about the data. Not yet, but you're gonna tell me, <laughs> right? You know you're gonna tell me everything. You boys can go. Looks like my plans have changed. It's not as bad as you think, Commander. Jalid and I just got a little over our heads. Keep talking. <laughs> the company we work for developed an experimental procedure for use in medical scanners. Jalid and I saw even more potential, so we stole the plans and secretly developed a tool to scan the keepers. Can you imagine a tool that can actually get readings from the keepers? Well, we know why this is a big deal, but we gotta pretend like we don't, apparently, in this conversation. 
what's so special about that? The keepers are almost impossible to scan, and you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct. After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. You've seen it yourself, Commander. You know we can do it. So... Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. Khalid's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. <laughs> I don't know. Sigh. <laughs> so you're just trying to get back what Jalid already stole. We lost our heads. We just couldn't let an opportunity like this. As much as I'd by. like to sigh, I know that Amanda, she won't just sigh. <laughs> if you'll just right. continue gathering data for me, imagine what we might learn. Well, I'm one away, you so. To make a bit of a profit yourself, remember? Yeah, no, no problem. Yeah, if it'll help further the scientific cause, how can I refuse? Very good. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with Jalid. Yeah, we'll do that. Data you're gathering for me is useless if Jalid won't help me analyze it. You got I'll it. I'll go have a chat with him right now. Thank you. Not right now. We'll, we'll talk standing, to him Commander. later. <laughs> but thank you. Thanks for being straight with me, Torben. Okay, here we go. I'm going to make sure. Yep, I still got my shotgun. Let's see. Um, Garrus, you, you, you snippy snipe. And yep, you got your shotgun out. And I should probably actually put some points into everybody, eh? Let's see. I I do like barrier. I do want to get barrier, so let's put at least one point towards that. Um, adrenaline burst, tactical armor. I don't get tactical armor until here. Might focus on getting us barrier. Barrier is kind of nice to have. Yeah. Yeah, we have a barrier now. And. It's weird that we have to unlock shotguns, even though it's like our specialty. I don't understand it, but that's okay. We'll put a point towards that and maybe another point into Vanguard. All right, Garrus. Guess what, buddy? <laughs> Guess what? You are going to be... <laughs> wow. <laughs> because... Um... Uh, so close. Wait, I have one more. I have a point. Why can't I? Why won't it let me? It says I have a point. Fine. Take one into an agent. <laughs> because Garrus is just one of the best characters to be all well rounded. Unless you want to constantly be, be bringing Caden along with you. Uh -huh. Garrus and Tali, they're your tech people. Nice. So. Alright, let's see here. Alright, buddy. Krogan Battlemaster. I shall give you at least two points into that. I shall give you some points into combat armor. I shall give you... Uh, do I need that for shotguns? Yes. Okay. Overkill. Uh, I'm going to unlock fitness for you because that's that's good. Um, you, yeah, he's not going to use his biotics that much. Uh, one more into Krogan Battlemaster. And one more towards shotguns. How about that? Sounds like a plan. Equipment! Wow, we got some stuff. Um, who actually is going to use these? Sometimes Rex, you're going to use them. So here, have an Avenger. Uh, that's the same. Uh, you're probably not going to be messing with that. So, Garrus, do I have a better one for you? This is a little bit better. And I, I trust you with accuracy because you're not me. <laughs> uh, let's see. Ooh. Duration isn't as good. The cooldown's better. I'd be down for that. Let's do that. And... Mm, nah. So. Here you go, buddy. Okay. Good enough. Let's go. Actually, I was going to go in shotgun blazing, but maybe we'll also go sniper as we're going in. Shut down? Bye. I 
There's somebody back there. Oh my gosh, dude. Ooh, so we got me. Bye bye. All right, we're gonna have to go around to get that guy. Come on, let's go, buddies. Ooh, uh, switching. Ooh, barrier. Nope. I actually do want to come down here. Thank you. Oh, he's getting his health back already. Krogan's uh, regenerate really quickly. That's part of why they're so tough. Hello? This one dude. Um. Oh my gosh! <laughs> they pushed the- they pushed the box! Yeah. <laughs> Y'all blocking the door! That's a fire hazard! Perimeter clear. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Two seconds. Alright, I'm going to... Uh, how do I put... How do I put... Yes, this is what I want. Uh, basic rounds or armor piercing? Let's go armor piercing. Yeah. I'm not gonna worry about you guys having any just yet. Hello! Stop right there! Don't come any closer! Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot! Oh look, we can finally do one of these. Nice. Y you might want to go. I'm I'm gonna say maybe you should go. Yeah, 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 for this sure. This a good time to find somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good idea. Yeah, I never like fist anyway. <laughs> it would have been quicker to just kill them. Shooting people isn't always the answer. Yay, Paragon points. Random weapon locker. Gimme, gimme. Hang on, guys. I gotta play some Frogger. Hang on. <laughs> Hang on. Woo! Look at all that. Just the door was like closing back. Like, oh, never mind. <laughs> Could you? All right. Ow! You guys be careful. You. I didn't tell you go into cover, so please go in cover. There we go, there's one. Nice. That's two. Wait! Don't kill me, I surrender. <laughs> Smart move. I mean, these are both basically the same. Smart move. <laughs> Where's the quarian? She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait. I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The Quarian isn't here. Said she'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker. Ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. You son of a bitch. <laughs> we have to save her. Where's the meeting? Give me the location. Let's go. Now. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. What are you doing? The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. So, I agree that he deserved it, but we are going to make an important point by saying he technically surrendered. Right. We don't shoot unarmed prisoners. How many people died because of him? He brought this on himself. Besides, also fair. <laughs> we have right. Concerns. That Quarian's dead if we don't go now. Don't worry about it. We, uh, we, we, I need this disc. Thank you. I also want to play some Frogger. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Gimme. Uh, yep. Yeah. 
serious crime in this hall. This is not the time. <laughs> I thought you'd have something more specific to say. Right, let's, get, <laughs> right. let's get rocking. What? Did you, girl? Hello? I don't know why she's not pulling out her weapon. Uh, you need to be using this. Um, you switch to this for now. Cause I gave you a new one. Hello? I'm gonna shoot you in the foot. <laughs> wow, what a what what a what a, what a great cover you have over there. We just love it. That's funny. Done, 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 and done. Skis. I'm gonna pull this, whip this out now. Intense music. Go. Running. Good thing I know where I'm going. I, I think I actually messed this up the first time because I had no idea where to go. <laughs> I was totally <laughs> confused. Let me in. Yeah, I can see how it's easy to get turned around for sure. Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Boom. Oh, oh boy. That took that guy a second to whip out <laughs> his weapon. No fighting around the keepers. It's not nice. Oh my god, don't stand next to Karis. I'm gonna shoot the wrong one. <laughs> Punch you. Punch you. Why isn't it letting me shoot? Like my oh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe my maybe the sabo. Somebody saboed me, maybe. Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Give me the evidence. No, are you okay? Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? Um, let's be friends. <laughs> I'm with the Alliance, nah. My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We Fair can enough. take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. Yep. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards and all out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many How many aliens I've recruited? This? <laughs> what are you up to, Shepard? Shut up. <laughs> Jake and Making is your J, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, Miss My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. Uh -huh. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. Through our pilgrimage, we prove that we will contribute to the community, rather than being a burden on our limited resources. All right, keep talking. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the veil. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. 
Most of the core was wiped clean, but I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. We got him! <laughs> <laughs> what, what's a conduit? He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. What are Reapers? Are they some kind of new alien species? According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. I mean... <laughs> She's got the core right there. Right, yeah. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods. The pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. I mean... <laughs> Will mm. they believe it? Yeah, I mean, that's a good this question. This is a lot to handle. They might just ignore everything we tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audio files prove Saren's a traitor. All right, Captain's yes, Anderson, right. you're right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her, the Quarian? My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. But what about your pilgrimage? I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. <laughs> Who am I to judge whether she's ready for this? Yeah, come right. on, join us. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. <laughs> Okay, it's basically just gonna dump us off in the embassies. So let's see here. Um, while I don't really want her on the squad, we need her for for just a second. Just a second. Gonna need her. And who else do you wanna bring? Um. Well. Uh. Well, Rex sure is fun. All right. He's kind of a he's a funny little dude. Big dude, I guess. <laughs> he's a funny big dude. <laughs> huh. I get the feeling they're not used to seeing Krogan walking around up here. Yeah, I, I think so. I can't tell these Oh my god, why are you saying that you Ashley, please? This is why we can't have nice things, Ashley. Ashley. Right? He's right there. He's right there, Ashley. Ashley. <laughs> Gosh darn it.